Wow, hello my people. Thanks for subscribing to my channel. Your wish has always been my command. Thanks always. Well, meanwhile, this is another one. Alright, this is another one. Okay, hashtag answers. Lagos protesters reject food drinks sent by National Union of Road Transport Worker Chief MC Olu Omo. Okay, scores of protesters at Alausa Ikeja on Friday attacked a van believed to have been sent by Musiliu Akinsoya, popularly called MC Olu Omo, to deliver water and drinks to protesters. MC Oluomo, the chairman of the National Union of Road Transport Workers, NU Houghton, Lagos chapter, was accused by protesters of sponsoring the attack by armed talks on Thursday. MC Oluomo, the Lagos State Government and the Speaker of the Lagos State House of Assembly, Mudashiru Obasa, were accused of sending the armed talks to attack protesters on Thursday. They have all denied the allegations. The transport union chief in a video he shared on social media said could not have sent the talks. And the Premium Times reported how several protesters were injured at Alausa Ikeja on Thursday after talks armed with gun machetes, knives and axes attacked them. A day after the incident, MC Olomo attempted to redeem his image in the eyes of the protesters. He sent water and drink branded with his name. Some of the protesters, unaware of whom sent the packs, collected the drinks and drank from the water and drinks before a protester raised an alarm about the food. MC Olomo sent them, he wants to poison us, don't drink the water. He shouted. Other protesters who also checked the name on the bottles stated throwing the bottles at the white van that conveyed them. We don't want any support from MC Olomo. They are trying to break us. They want to penetrate again. Some protesters shouted. Angered by the gesture of the Nigerian Youth, Nigerian Union of Road Transport Worker Leader, the protesters threw bottles and other items at the van as the driver sped from the venue to avoid being mobbed. The NURTW is arguably the most influential transport union in Nigeria. Its members include private bus drivers and conductors and the thousands of garage boys popularly called Agberos who are known to assault bus drivers and commuters to demand money. Members of the NURTW are also often used as thugs by politicians in each state. In Lagos, MC Oluomo and the NURTW are believed to have a strong relationship with the governing party in the state APC. After protesters rejected MC Oluomo's gift, the hashtag answers protest continued in Alausa, Lagos, as in many states of Nigeria, despite various concessions by the government. Premium Times reported HOS, the government last Sunday, disbanded the notorious police unit, SAS, which was the major demand of the protesters. The government has also pledged to ensure the prosecution of officers who assaulted and killed some protesters and ensure freedom for all arrested protesters. On Thursday, the National Economic Council, headed by Vice President Yemi Oshibajo, approved that state governors set up independent judicial panels to probe police harassment in each state and that committees set up by state governors should have oversight and any new police unit formed. Why 
I have never done this before. I don't do this. Thank you and God bless you. That was MC Oluomo on this one. Well, what more can we say? The truth of the matter is that life continues. Well, the protest continues and as it is, Nigerians, the youth right now are not ready to back off and they are ready to support it till the end they want justice we want every of our agitation and what we've been clamoring for we want it to be accomplished that is what the youth are saying right now well the mc olomo has debunked the news that he never sent any talk please i did not do that because even me myself i am one of the protesters we know what is going on in this country and then um, we are trying to put a stop to that then why would i now come from nowhere to say i want to send talks well the truth of the matter another thing is who now sent these people what is their mission what do they want are they not part of this country are they not nigerian as in i don't understand what is going on? Why would some thoughts come from nowhere? That is to tell you that in this country that we have a lot of things, a lot of bad things are happening. And that is to tell you that there are some people that are actually supporting these sacks. Because I am very sure they must have had returns. They must be getting returns from these people. That is why they can come out to say they want to disrupt the activities of these people that are fighting for the good of the land. Oh my God. That is to tell you that everybody needs to shine his or her eyes to see what is happening well and at the same time right now the youth because of this they are not ready to relent in their efforts anymore we have to face it we have to push it up the way it is in case you don't know the un is in support of this protest and that is to tell you that the president himself should be very careful about what he does thanks so much on this one meanwhile let me have more takes from you and remember to subscribe for more updates thanks and god bless